Hello, season's greetings to you. This is Michael, and I'm here to bring you the latest episode in the Historic Soldiers Christmas series. Today is December 22, 2013, and this episode's focus is on the Second Anglo-Boer War. This conflict took place from October 1899 until May 1902. It is very apropos that I am filming a video pertaining to the Christmas experience during the Second Anglo-Boer War because it was unseasonably warm here on the East Coast, and we know that Christmas time in South Africa takes place during that nation's summer season. Right now I have for you a page featuring a print from a book. The title of the book is After Praetoria, The Guerrilla War, Volume 2. It was published in the year 1902. The title of the print is Christmas on the Velt. Right now I'm going to turn the camera over so you can get a closer look at this print that was published in the year 1902. This is page 889 of the book. At the top of the page, Casualties at Tafel Cup would have been printed and December 20, 1901. Once again, this was published in 1902. I believe it was released during the tail end of the conflict. Here you see the British soldiers. The title below the print is Christmas on the Velt. Underneath the text is as follows. Arrangements were made by the Field Force Canteen, which ensured that every soldier in the field should have plum pudding and beer with his dinner on Christmas Day and a pipe and tobacco to follow. I have two Christmas pudding related stories for you. They come from the Second Anglo Boer War. Christmas Day, 1899. A shell sent by the Boers landed on the side of the British troops. It failed to detonate. It was opened and engineers found Christmas pudding inside. There is a message, I quote, with the compliments of the season. Apparently the Boers sent a gift to the British soldiers. That same Christmas, Queen Victoria sent a message to the Somersetshire Regiment. I wish you and all my brave soldiers a happy Christmas. God protect and bless you all. I have one more story for you. Two years ago, an original can of pudding was found in someone's home, specifically in a kitchen cupboard. It was donated to a museum. This pudding was sent to members of the Naval Brigade in the year 1900. Once again, this was an unopened can or tin. It is now housed 
in a museum. I thank all of you for watching and learning about this one instance of the Second Anglo-Boer War, a severely overlooked conflict in our world's history. I thank you once again, and I wish you a very Merry Christmas. Goodbye.